A local soldier made the ultimate sacrifice. One of the three American soldiers killed in a roadside explosion in Afghanistan yesterday. Good evening, Air Force Staff Sergeant Dylan Elchin's body will be Air Force Base tomorrow. The 25 year old will be brought home to Beaver County for a funeral before he is buried in Arlington National Cemetery. John Shumway says Dylan's mom wants everyone to know he was proud of his service and she was proud of him. Long before his senior year at Hopewell High School, Dylan Elchin knew his future. When he was about 14, he started reading books about special services. But he didn't tell his mom until he graduated in 2012. He said, I'm going to enlist. He went with my dad. In the Air Force, following the military path of his big brother Aaron, but Donna felt comfort in his choice of the Air Force. I didn't know we were jumping out of airplanes and diving underwater and all the things he was doing. During his time in uniform, mother and what she calls her goofball son have stayed in touch. You know, mother's worry and mother's, as long as I could look on the phone and see his green button, I knew we were okay. Along the way, Dylan met and got engaged to Jordan. Then came his first deployment to Afghanistan. I didn't want him to go. He said, Mom, I'll be okay. And I said, Dylan, so if anything happens to you, I said, is this going to destroy me? And he said, Mom, I'll be fine. Mom, I'll be fine. This big smile on his face, I'll be fine. But when he left out that door and I hugged him, I said, it's in God's hands now. And he said, Mom, I'll be fine. Since July, Dylan Elchin has been with Special Forces on patrol, coordinating air support for ground operations. He had plans for when his tour ends next year. I think he said he was going to come and visit us first, and then they were going to elope. But he told us about it. So how do you elope when you tell us about it? And when they FaceTimed on Thanksgiving Day, Mom put in a plug for grandchildren. And he looked at me with his face, and he said, oh, no, no, not yet. We're not having children yet. And he just made that face. That mean he said the world isn't ready for any more Dylan Elchins yet. She knew that he was going out on a week-long patrol. And I just said, well, when you're done call me or message me so I know you're okay. Then came yesterday morning and as the world was seeing these images. I got a knock on my door and there was two uniformed people at my door and I knew. I didn't want to let them in. I knew right away what it was. They didn't even have to say a word. I knew what it was. Donna and the family are on their way to stand on the tarmac at Dover Air Force Base to see what so many other families have seen before. And she doesn't know if she has the strength. I never thought I'd be doing this. In Chippewa, Beaver County, John Shumway, KDKA TV News.